hey guys YouTube ads are going to be really really big in 2019 because YouTube is growing at a very rapid pace and the people are spending a lot of time on YouTube even more than Facebook now YouTube is bigger than Facebook today and YouTube ads are very important for you if you want to get really inexpensive clicks from really targeted traffic the problem is it's very hard to make sense of YouTube ads and find the right targeting so YT ad keyword analyzer is an app that's going to help you with that to get started the first thing we need is the set of keywords that we can use to target ads on Google Ads but to YouTube to do that let's get a set of keywords click on keywords planner and we will use Google's keywords planner to download a CSV of the files that we that we can analyze then in YouTube ads analyze so I'm putting in a keyword clicking on get started and that's going to give me a bunch of keywords that I can target total of 574 rows 574 keywords and I want to download all those keywords to do that first click on the checkbox over here and select some keywords and you want to select all the available options not just the 10 or whatever page size you might have click on select all the options and then you will see that all the keywords are selected and we need to download those so scroll a little bit and you will see a button over here download keyword ideas click on it it's going to prepare the report and give you a CSV file that just in a few seconds so here we got the CSV file right over here you can see all this data in the CSV file frankly speaking you can you can have a tough time trying to make a sense of it but with the YT ads keywords it's going to be so much easier let's try and do that so here I am back in the traffic youth loader and I've clicked on YT ad keywords and I've got YT ad keywords the first thing I want to import that CSV file click on the import button select the file and you can see that there's a lot of data already here you'll find the keywords the difficulty in ranking for these keywords the top views top likes top comments these columns are empty but I'll show you very soon how to get that data then you've got the average searches and finally the CPC which is the cost per click for for the keyword in question wherever it's found wherever it's applicable so to get started first we need to put in this data so to do that there's a play button there is a get YouTube Google data button over here just click it and now YT ad keywords is going to look on Google and get you this data so you can see yt ad keywords is getting the data right now it's going to fill up the list pretty rapidly but you can continue working with it if you want you can continue working with it now and if you want to stop this process just click on stop and this will stop and yt ad keywords will not get the data for the rest of the keywords so we've got the data for a bunch of keywords let's just stop the process now and now let's see how we can quickly very quickly identify the keywords that fit our criterion to do that here's the button over here that will let us select the options to highlight the keywords that meet up meet our criterion and we can set up various things like Google difficulty competition level top number of views top likes top comments average searches and the CPC so you can you can select any of these criterion you want for example let's try some settings so let's say we want uh, we want all the keywords with a google difficulty of less than 10 percent and competition should be less than eight let's say top views should be less than let's say these many top likes less than this and top comments okay what about uh, 1000 let's see if we get anything click on OK and then click on highlight you will see all the keywords that match your criterion so you can quickly shortlist and find the keywords that match the criterion you have in your mind and you can of course add the CPC so if you want any uh, if you want any uh, CPC that matches the requirement let's say for example less than three click on the highlight and you will find all the videos that match the criterion that you've set out and all the settings that you have put up so that you can exactly identify the keywords that you want to use and with a stroke of one button over here you can see a button that says remove unhighlighted you can remove all the keywords that were not in your use that does not that do not meet your criterion and just take the keywords that meet your criterion 
and you can export them to a CSV file and import them into Google Docs and start running your ads right then. There are some other options also and I quickly want to show you all the options on this toolbar before we end this demo. So after this we've got paste keywords so if you want to put in any keywords manually use the paste keywords command to bring in fresh keywords and we've got a facility to improve only the keywords text file so if there is no adjoining data from a google ads file and you just want the keywords text file you just want the keywords list you can import that too you can export the keyword list into a text file you can export the entire data set into a csv you can highlight if you have got some special keywords in mind that you want to just make sure that you are working with you can highlight them or you can choose to unhighlight the specific keywords that you won't, don't want to work with and you can highlight it again so that you can remove all the unhighlighted one list later and just take the highlighted keywords and export it the auto highlight feature works according to this whatever rules you set up it will be auto highlighted whenever you press the auto highlight button then you've got the select all to select everything and if you want to delete any of the keywords that you've selected click on delete button and then if you want some help on this if you want to know how this software works click on the help button and finally the exit program button so this is how yt ad keywords works it's a great little app to find you the perfect keywords to use to run on google ads for the video for your video campaigns and using this software you can identify the cheapest keywords that can give you the best results for your video ads.